An update for you now to a consumer justice investigation we brought you last night at 10 o'clock. The Attorney General's office is now getting involved into the investigation of three North Texas driving schools. Investigator Kristen Severance broke this story. She joins us in Dallas with the developing details. Kristen? Ken, since our first post on this story, more than 250 people have commented and it's reached nearly 500,000 people on Facebook. And we have new details this afternoon about the state's fight to get missing information, get missing documents. We know the state has subpoenaed the owners of two North Texas driving schools that shut down suddenly in February. The owners must produce records at AABC Driving School in Irving and Academy One Driving School in Euless for the last three years. Well, the Deadline on that subpoena has passed. So the state is now asking the Attorney General's office to enforce it. The only problem, both owners say they don't have the documents. We told you last night that thousands of driver's licenses may be revoked because of forgery claims at those shutdown schools and a third school, Alliance Driving School in Wataga. That school is still open. Well, the man whose name is all over tens of thousands of driving records at the schools says his signature was forged. He says it could have been happening for the last 10 years. This signature shows that the teacher of record oversaw everything. Yes, and if, if this signature wasn't on there, they would not be completing the course and getting their driver's license. So the Texas Education Agency oversaw all driving schools until the TDLR took over in 2015. Now the Texas Department of Licensing and Regulation told us that they can impose fines if those forgery claims turn out to be true. But Ken, the Department of Public Safety would ultimately make the decision on if any licenses would be revoked over the forgery issue. So lots to stay on top of here, lots to follow up on. Absolutely. And we're going to check with you just as soon as you get new details on this. Great work, Kristen. Thanks so much. Folks, if Thanks. you need consumer justice, be sure to contact Kristen. Just call 817-586-7211. You can also email her at consumerjustice at ktvt.com.